What is up, Gilly Crew, and welcome back from Rev. Part one has already dropped. It is a six part series, but I figured I would take a moment and show you guys some of the collection that I acquired in the wasteland. Scavenged some and was gifted some by some subscribers I met. You guys were killer. I didn't know how to do you guys that come up and talk to me were subscribed. Big shout out to Bear Squad for the victory at the end. You guys will see that coming soon. But let's go over some of these items. Obviously, we all like our Fallout storylines. This was my first Rev. So we have the Rev Omega Fallout guy. And then moving on, we got a patch from Charlie of Spegna Arms, which I linked up with him at Z6. And we become close friends. I actually have now two Spegna Arms and reviews. That one you've seen, one coming up in two weeks. We have a Santa. I met Santa Claus and made the nice list. But you got to believe in order to get this coin. If you do not believe in Santa or even Rev Santa, you are going to get not a coin, but a big old hunk of coal. And you get one of these if you do not attend Rev as well, because this was brought back for a special person behind the camera. But there's the coin. Check that out. Then we're going to move on to a special item. This bandana right here was part of the squad that I met day one that decided to let me and two of my friends run with them. They also are known as Airsoft Louisiana, but we know them as the Raging Cajuns. Shout out to you guys for getting that victory with us. I'm glad we all survived on day two. And to show that Louisiana pride, we also got a Mardi Gras coin. And then, of course, continuing with Santa, what's better than getting a Santa patch and a Believe Bell? That means you should subscribe right now over there. So I know I got it right. We'll move those off to the side. Bear Squad. I made a trade in the parking lot for an item. You know who you are and you know what you got. But I got two Ryan Gosling pins for it. We got to show those up close. Nice, Ryan. Great work, bud. Love your movies. Next up, we have the custom blade holder by Andrew. One of the guys I ran with, met him day one, and continued to run with him during day two. Dropped a magic prize under the table. Had to get it. So we'll put that in the pocket so you guys can't see that yet. Then we'll go on to one of my most unique and favorite items. This is a custom scope made by Mange. I will put his link in the description of this video as well. Um... I made him a cool stem pack to trade for this. And we'll show that on the overview. Got a carabiner clip. Can't remember who gave it to me, but they said to hold on tightly and handed this to me. And they said, wait, let me clip it to you. I thought they were going to put a leash on me or something because it was crazy. Next, we have my good friends, Talon Company. Which, Kendrick, shout out to you. Told you I would shout it out. The claw goes down. I remember my assistant trying to get me to flip it the wrong way. Next up, Pew Pew Vids. If you don't know this guy, you should subscribe. He just hit 12,000 subscribers. Go make it 13 for him. Our Bala Hat guy. That's the Omega. We'll show that one up close. 
Next up, we have the Hug Patrol. We'll show this one up close as well. And some other cool gifts from Reb Santa. We got a stocking with candy and a pistol Barrett flash hider or whatever you want it to be. I put it on the Chris Vector and it looks absolutely insane. So yeah, that's awesome. Um, like I said, big shout out to Fred for being a subscriber. Thank you so much for doing that and saying you like my channel. That makes my day because I was not expecting anybody to know who I was in Chesapeake, Virginia. Next up, we have our COV scavenger patch. This one is awesome. It's all leather. It did not come with Velcro, so I made it Velcro so I can put it on the patch wall. We'll definitely show that one. And then we have a series of Balahack things. Balahack patch one. Balahack patch two. Balahack red patch. And Swamp Sniper patch. And then we have a Balahack Airsoft barrel bag. We have our armband because that event was epic. Yeah, I said it. Sue me. Swamp Sniper. It's fun to say. There is the new currency of the Rev series for this year. It is called Atom. And if you have more than one, it is still called Atom. So if you have 30 of these, it would be 30 Atom, not Atoms. There was a debate that day. You'll have to see the video. And of course, what Rev event would not be worthwhile if you didn't bring home a stim pack? Yes, this is a water gun in real life. But in the wasteland, this is how you survive. This is how you bring your friends back to life. This is the stimmiest stim pack that you could ever get your hands on. Only at Rev. Get yours exclusively from my sponsor, Nobody. Nobody sponsored this video. So I hope you subscribe so maybe we can get some. And the last item on the table is something that's very awesome to me. On episode four, we have some exciting things that go down. As you guys know, C7 Viper, the Candyman, is one of the highly visited role players of Rev. Well, me and my good friend Jay, a.k.a. True Mobster, subscribe to his channel as well because he's awesome. We did a raid on the Candyman, and the reward was the Cygnus Armory new face shield, which I will be making some other posts about them very soon. But I'm going to lay everything out on the table, get you guys a little slow-mo pass, and until next time, guys, thank you for watching, and I will see you on the field.
And you guys thought that was all. So I hope you stuck around to the end because this is your sneak peek to the end of the series that is coming in five more episodes after this video. So not only did we get all this amazing stuff from subscribers, friends, new friends, and loads more, we also won at our very first Rev event that we attended, Rev Omega. So let's show this off. And then we chose a certain route that you will learn about. I'm not going to give you any more details. So now, for real, until next time, until next time, I will see you on the field.